hey guys what's going on one of the top crypto exchanges ftx is completely gone and uh, just imagine how can it get more worse than it that they have also been hacked now i'm gonna tell you something which will definitely shock you i mean this is a different opinion my opinion and uh, i might be true i might be wrong so watch the whole video this will surprise you because there is a catch with this hack all this hack thing so let's start with the story ftx faces potential hack sees mysterious outflows totaling more than 600 million dollars now this is crazy news right here i mean if you guys just think about it like can you imagine why ftx got hacked uh, right after it's it's getting a uh, like issues of in insolvency we are ha ftx is having big trouble right now and this exchange is totally done ftx token is down 95 percentage it's totally in the dust the ftx ftt token is at the floor price it's totally dust nobody wants to buy that token right now and on top of that we have this crazy uh ftx hack I mean this doesn't make sense like if you guys just think like why is this happening now i mean if F ftx uh oh i mean if it 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 i mean if it could get hacked this this may have been this may have happened earlier before this whole all thing i hope you guys are understanding what i'm trying to say as you guys apparently see this ftx has currently uh disabled the withdrawals and they strongly advise against depositing and deposits of tokens such as TRX, BTT, JST, Sun and HT are disabled. Now guys, here is a catch. So let's go to this post. FTX is currently getting hacked. So here are all the updates. So official FTX has been hacked and this has been posted by the admin of ftx community chat on telegram his name is uh, ray and he posted this in the telegram uh, announcing the hack now that's crazy well so let's so let's go through this complete story then i will tell you what could be very suspicious about all these hack story so multiple former ftx employees confirm that they do not recognize these transfers for somewhere around 383 million dollars so there have been uh, tr transfers from the exchange and none of the employees are confirming to these transfers this is very shady i don't trust these moving on so there is a high probability insiders at ftx are currently trying to run off with funds and both FTX and FTX US wallets have now been affected and coming, I don't know how to even pronounce that word. And the current amount being laundered is around 380 million. Now, this is crazy stuff happening right now. This is one of the craziest week in the history of crypto. We haven't seen such a big exchange collapsing in just less than a week. This is crazy stuff. And I'll tell you why this has happened. And coming up to the next tweet, some of the wallets are labeled as uh, F, SBF, F, FTX, and SBF.eth. So this could be a reverse optics to appear as if it is a hack. Anything is possible. So, guys, here's what I think. This is my opinion. Let's start with this. So, I think this whole uh, FTX exchange getting hacked. Thing, I think this could be fake. Why? Because if you guys see that Sam Bankman Freed, he has been trying to uh, halt the withdrawals. He he's been trying to stop people from from withdrawing money from the exchange because if people starts withdrawing, they would go bank bankrupt, and they have already gone bankrupt. And this and this is the reason why they're st stopping people from a withdrawing and this has caused insolvency which is uh panicking the investors in the entire crypto market right now and this is a crazy thing 
And I believe the reason why they and and I believe the reason why they made this whole hack thing is only to stop stop the users from withdrawing. If you guys see that, let me show you the the official uh, official announcement by the FTX uh, by the admin in the Telegram group of FTX. So he said FTX has been hacked. All funds seem to be gone. FTX apps are malware. Delete them. Chat is open. Don't go to FTX site as it might download Trojans. So if you guys just see, there's no point. Even if it's even if it's been hacked, like how can they deploy malware? That doesn't seem possible because if you use an Android or an iPhone, that doesn't make sense. Your phone cannot get automatically frozen into your phone. And if you go to and if you visit the FTX website uh, via browser, it's not possible for them to deploy frozen into your computer if you don't download anything. So the thing is, I think they made this whole thing up so you don't withdraw your funds, you don't use. Because if you try to withdraw funds from their exchange, this will make everything even worse. But this is natural. If FTX is collapsing, I mean, why you should not withdraw your funds? Because they are at risk. And we had a similar FUD yesterday regarding uh, Tether USDT. So everyone was crazy. Everyone was panicking, saying that USDT will. Uh, Depeg from one dollar value, and uh, and and as a result of result of that, many crypto USDT holders converted their USDT into BUSD coin, which is own which is a Binance stable coin. And if you also hold USDT, it's up to you if you want to convert your uh, USDT tether into BUSD. This might help. So guys, this is a crazy thing, and let me go down. Let let me show you something. So CoinDesk has been covering this story with full dedication. That they, they are revealing and exposing the truth. So let's read this. So the transfers which have not been addressed officially by FTX leadership come on the so come on the same day that the firm officially filed for Chapter Eleven bankruptcy protection after apparently losing billions of dollars in user funds if you read this clearly you guys see that the so the 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 so the so the transfer that have been made after the hack happened on the same day when they file for the chapter 11 bankruptcy so what could this mean this could mean that i think this is some insider this is some insider thing so they are making it to look like as it as it is a hack but it's not actually a hack i believe the the employees are withdrawing the user funds and they're trying and they're trying to run off with funds of you guys of users fund so this is very crazy and very bad to be honest and it looks crazy at the moment so i mean everyone is so this is the top story right now. Uh, if you go to Twitter and uh, search for hashtag FTX hack, you will see a lot of people giving their opinion. And this one story is really crazy. So they're saying that Sam Bankman Freed has so has fled from Bahamas to Argentina, and I think. Uh, he is trying to run away from this whole thing as i'm i think he's scared or what i don't know we we have to see what's gonna happen next to this whole ftx thing uh there is no hope right now for ftx this is sad but it's true and we have cz also uh saying something so he said he so cz the founder of binance he said what a shit show it's going to be crypto's fall instead of one guy's fall. So he is uh, like directly crit criticizing Sam Bankman Freed for causing this whole crash in crypto market and the and the whole collapse of the FTX exchange, which I think he could be true because 
we already knew that Sang Bank Bankman Freed have made his entire crypto wealth on arbitrage. And if you don't know, arbitrage is basically selling Bitcoin with a price difference on different exchanges in different countries. Or it could be different, but I think CZ is right. This story is crazy. And I think I should wrap this video here and I'll be back with another uh, update video on this whole thing whenever I have an update. So thank you so much for watching. Subscribe to the channel and I'll be right back. See you guys later.